Alright, in this video I will be going through a mind map on module 4 of AQA A-Level Spanish, which is La Influencia de los Idolos. This is going to be a short video, but hopefully you will feel much more confident on this topic after watching this video. So, here is the mind map. It is split up into the three spec points. 4.1 Cantantes y Musicos, 4.2 Estrellas de Televisión y Cine, and 4.3 Modelos. I have also added a section for Deporte, as athletes are often a good example of celebrities, whether that's for positive or negative reasons, which you can talk about in the speaking exam. In the speaking exam, you get marked based on your knowledge of Hispanic society. Therefore, the more examples you can give, the better. Let's zoom into 4.1. For positive influence, a great example is Shakira and her charity La Fundación de Pies Descalzos, which she started at age 18, and it provides education and nutrition to over 6,000 impoverished children in Colombia. Also, she is an ambassador of UNICEF, and has been since El Año 2003. On the negative side, a good example is reggaeton, which is a genre of music. Bad Bunny is a singer of reggaeton music, which was highly unpopular by women, as it was often sex sexist and degrading. Shakira also has a controversy. She evaded taxes between the years 2012 and 2014. Prensa Rosa means celebrity magazine, and is very pop popular in Spain, and often features scandalous stories about celebrities. Moving on to 4.2, Estrellas de Televisión y Cine. Penelope Cruz is a Spanish actress with a positive influence. She was born in Madrid and is now an international star because of her acting. She has volunteered in countries worldwide and spent time working with Mother Teresa. La Oveja de Van Gogh es un grupo musical español. Lanzó la campaña por ser niña, which means to be a girl. The campaign raises awareness to people about gender discrimination. Concienciar and sensibilizar both mean to raise awareness. Gael García Bernal is a Mexican actor and director. At the age of 14, he taught literacy to indig indigenous peoples in Mexico. He is known for his work in movies that show taboo relationships. Finally, for positive influence, you can talk about Salma Hayek, who is a Mexican actress. She is a spokesperson for UNICEF and fights against gender discrimination. Importantly, she breastfed a hungry child in Africa, which caused a lot of controversy. Two people you can mention who have done something to attract negative attention in cinema is Danny Rivera and Alejandro Iñárritu. Danny made a joke about the worst things about Ibiza during a speech, which offended many people from Ibiza. Danny later apologised on Twitter. Similarly, in 2015, Alejandro suggested that Mexico needs a new government. Obviously, this caused a lot of political chaos and shows that celebrities should not mix with politics. Moving on to Modelos. In 2006, La Pasarela Atibeles, Madrid Fashion Week, banned overly skinny models from their shows. This was to prevent models being put under pressure by the industry to become skinny. In the topic of models, plastic surgery is an easy thing you can mention. The positives, the negatives and its effect on the youth. The textbook talks about a young child and how they would feel seeing overly perfect bodies in magazines. Ruben Lopez was named the most beautiful man in the world and was crowned Mr. Universe in 2014. Despite this, he remains hardworking and is a soldier in the army. Lastly, Deporte. Messi is an ambassador for UNICEF. He's also very humble and does not let his fame or wealth get to him. Nadal has had a lot of injuries, but because of, but because of his positive attitude, he's very successful. Of course, they are both extremely talented as well. Luis Suarez is an example of attracting negative attention in sports. He has a history of biting people, and most famously in the 2014 World Cup. So, that is my mind map on Module 4. All this information is mainly needed for the speaking card and the speaking exam. I hope you feel more confident on this topic. There are loads more examples you can mention, however, these are only a handful of them. Feel free to screenshot this mind map and stick it in your notes. Thank you for watching.